Today it's PSA Day. And because this is such a big reveal, I'm giving away three of these slabs to three lucky subscribers. So of course you have to be subscribed and like the video and leave a comment down in the comment section to enter the giveaway. We got a huge haul today. Let's just get into it. Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. We have 65 cards to get to. We got Vintage, we got Paradox Rift, we got 151, we got the goods. Let's check this card out. We got the Slowpoke from Fossil, Golden Oldie. I'm gonna guess a nine. Nice. To start it off, we got Mint 9 Vintage card. All right, let's keep the ball rolling. We got a modern Japanese card. These are always pristine. Japanese Charizard, I mean 10, it's easy. Gem Mint 10, Radiant Charizard from V-Star Universe. First 10 of our opening, very cool. And it's a Charizard, no less. There's a little whitening down at the bottom there, nothing too crazy. Iron Hands EX Full Art from Paradox Rift. I'm gonna guess a nine on this. All right, sweet, yep, nine. I, I like the Iron Hands EX. That's a cool new Pokemon. Next up, uh, looks great on the back. Sylveon VMAX Trainer Gallery from Brilliant Stars. I am gonna go with a nine. Oh, really? That's a beautiful artwork. All right, so far we got two tens right out of the gate. And this card is looking good as well. Mew EX from 151. I'm gonna guess a 10 on this. Nice, our third gem mint 10. Sweet. We are just rolling in the tens. Three out of fives. Very minimal edge wear, but centering is great. The Steelix Illustration Rare from Paradox Rift. I think it's worthy of a nine at least. Yeah, there we go. Mint nine. This is one of my favorite new illustration rares. I really like this artwork. All right, next up, more Japanese. The Reverse Hollow Magikarp, Japanese 151. This one is not the Master Ball, it's just the regular Pokeball Reverse Hollow. I'm gonna guess a 10. That's good, Mint 9. All right, here we go. The Chiyu EX Special Illustration Rare. I'm gonna guess a 9 on that. Whoa, really? I will definitely take the 10. <laughs> Very nice i love this artwork got four tens so far a little off center nothing crazy yeah here we go we got the base set unlimited dugong this is 10 worthy come on give me a gem mint 10 vintage card yes 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 gem mint 10 it may not be everybody's favorite pokemon and it may just be an uncommon but this is base set people come on i am excited about this one i pretty much sent in all the commons and uncommons from the base set pack opening minus the energies yes the magikarp base set unlimited i'm going to be conservative and guess a nine but i could definitely believe a 10. mint nine I will definitely take that. I love the OG Magic Card. I mean, come on. This is bringing me back. I am loving this. There are more vintage cards to come, people. Fossil Unlimited Golem. Uncommon card. I'm going to guess a nine. We got the eight. I, I kind of figured it was going to be an eight or a nine. But I will take that. All right. Centering is good. The Mela Fool Art from Paradox Rift. I'm going to guess a nine. Right on, mint nine. Just like the other return, we're swimming in eights, nines, and tens. Nothing lower than an eight so far. Let's keep that going. We got five tens so far, including a vintage. Very minimal edge wear up at the top. Garchomp EX Full Art, Paradox Rift. I'm gonna guess a nine. Sixth gem mint 10, nice. All right, here we go. Looks great on the back. Shadow Rider Kellerix V Alternate Art from Chilling Rain. I'll guess a nine on this one. Gem Mint 10. We are swimming in tens right now. Nice. Here we go. Next up, Cynthia's Ambition. Glaring Gallery from Crown Zenith. I'm going to guess an eight on this, to be honest. Hey, another Gem Mint 10. I will take it. Cynthia's Ambition from Crown Zenith. Our Gem Mint 10 stack is piling high, people. 
the Charizard V promo from the Champion's Path ETB. I'm gonna guess a nine on this. Yep, nine. Sweet. Keep my Charizards in nines and tens, please. Centering is good. The Manectric EX Full Art from Phantom Forces. I think it's a seven. Yep, I was right. Near Mint seven. That is okay though. It's a cool card. All right, next up. Looks great to me. Tapu Coco EX, special illustration rare. We're going gem at 10 on this guy. Nice. Man, we are doing so good. Most of these are pack fresh, of course, so nice. All right, next one up. Centering's decent. Magneton Hollow. I sent in two of these. I'm gonna guess a six, actually. A seven. I knew it was going to be around a six or seven. I'm fine with that. Vintage Hollow. Next up, Immaculate on the back. All right, here's our second Charizard V. I sent in two of these. I'm going 10 on this one. Yes. Yes. We got a nine and a 10. I'll take them both. Sweet. All right. Centering's great. Thunderous EX Full Art from Plasma Freeze. I'm going to guess a nine. Okay, that is not too much of a stretch to get an eight. That is a cool card. I will take that. Next up, here's our base set pack one. So I'm gonna guess an eight. Yep, pack fresh, but we still got an eight. I will take that beautiful. All right. Oh, our Mute 2 Hollow XY promo. I'm gonna have to go with an eight. Yep. I was right. When I pulled this out of the mystery box, this is the first time I'd seen this card. I love this card. All right, here we go. Next up, Minimal Edgeware, Salamence Dragon Vault Hollow. I think it's more of an eight. Yep, right again. I'm glad we're getting minimal sevens and no sixes. <laughs> Centering is off our haunch crow hollow this is beat up i just want to take a chance and see i didn't want to put a mysterious treasures hollow in the bulk pile didn't have it in me so this is probably more like a five right on the money excellent five hey i'll take it i won't whine about it sometimes you just got to take a chance see what happens ah the rattata from our base set opening. I'm going to go with a nine, but I wouldn't be surprised if it was a 10. Mint nine, boom, very nice. We're nearing the end of our first submission that came in and we're doing pretty darn good. This one looks great. Oh yes, we sent in two of the Tapu Coco EX specials. I'm gonna guess a 10. Okay, Mint 9, I will take that. And here is a TV animation card, and we all know what this one is, obviously. It's the Ash Ketchum card. There's some edge wear, but it's not crazy. I gotta go with at least a 9. Eh, okay. I'm glad we got at least an 8 on this. This one just brings me back. I love it. Got about 5 cards left. Galissapod EX Special Illustration Rare. We're just gonna slap a 10 on it. Yes! Yes, 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 again. That is a cool card. I love that. All right, centering is slightly off, but it's not terrible. Our Drowsy, also from Base Set Unlimited. Come on, give me a 10. Whoa, 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 whoa. What? There's our uh, first oddball of the bunch. Wow, okay, we will go with it and we'll just move on. Looks great to me. The Abra, give me the 10, come on. Yes, yes, another Gem Mint 10 vintage card. Give this video a like, people, come on. That's a beauty right there. Two more cards from the first submission. Edges are fine. Onyx, I know you're gonna give me another Gem Mint 10 vintage card, come on. I will take a mint nine. Shoot. And our last one from the first opening before we dive into the second. Centering is off a little bit. Ghastly. Final card is a vintage. I am going with a nine. Yep, very good. That is sweet. 12 gem mint tens so far. Give this video a like. Come on, let's go for round two. Let's just rip into these. Centering's off. Swablu Illustration Rare from Paradox. Nine. 
Yep, mint nine. I do like this swab blue. I just loved the artwork, so I wanted to send it in, see what happens. All right, this submission has a lot of 151. Caldeo, Galarian Gallery from Crown Zenith. I'm guessing a 10. Yes. Gem Mint 10, got another one. Next up, modern Japanese card. It's good on the back. The Charizard V from V Star Universe. It's gotta be a 10. Yes! Oh my gosh, I'm swimming in Gem Mint 10 Charizards, people. Back looks good, it always does. Roxanne, special art rare from V Star. Give me a Gem Mint 10 special art rare, come on. Holy cow, number 15. Oh, we're getting the tens on the good stuff. Here we go. Clara full art promo from the Clara Premium Tournament Collection. We're going for another 10. I don't see why not. Mint nine, I will take it. No problem. Little bottom heavy on the centering, so not great. Furisoed Girl Secret Rare from Silver Tempest. I'm gonna guess a nine conservatively. Eight. Hey, at least it wasn't less than that. We'll take it. Here we go. Needle King Reverse Hollow Rare from Evolutions. I'm going to go with an eight. Actually, no, this is probably seven. Whoa. I don't know if I agree with that one. I think the most I would give it is an eight. But, um, hey, I'm not going to complain about it. Next up, Reverse Hollow Squirtle. Good old 151. Nine. Yep, and there we go. Mint nine. Love me some 151. It's it's like I'm opening base set again. Everything looks great. Gengar Hollow 151. Let's give it a nine. Oh, very nice. Yet another gem mint ten. A lot of 151 hollows today, and some reverse hollows. Raichu Hollow. I'm gonna guess a nine. Yep, we got the nine. Cool. We sat in two of the hollow right shoes. Nine. Yep, another nine. We'll take it. Centering is ever so slightly off. Nothing crazy. The Gyarados hollow. I'm gonna guess a ten. There we go. Gem mint ten. That's what I thought. It is immaculate. Nice. Next up. The centering is slightly off. The Flareon hollow. I'm gonna guess a nine, but I wouldn't be surprised if it was a ten. Mint nine. We will take that, no problemo. Looks good to me. We also sent in two of the Flareons. Now this one could be a 10. Yes! There we go. Gem Mint 10 Flareon 151. We're on a roll, people. Our Gem Mint 10s are piling up. Looks good. The Deoxys V-Star Special Art Rare from V-Star Universe. I'm going for a 10. Yes! Japanese cards are more than likely going to get tens. They're always immaculate. Centering is off. Rika Full Art from Paradox. It's probably more nine. Yep, mint nine. Follow that up with another Japanese card. Very, very minor edge where our Japanese writes you from the Pokemon card 151. Gonna guess a nine. Yep, mint nine. Our Dragonite Hollow. This Dragonite was the first Dragonite I ever pulled out of 151. And I like this Hollow. I really do. Nine. Really? We'll take a Gem Mint 10 Dragonite Hollow. All right, more Japanese. Yeah, looks good. The Mill Tank from V Star Universe. I mean, looks great. Gem Mint 10. Boom. I love it. Get those Japanese Gem Mint 10s. Here's another one. Let's go. Looks good. No problem there. Japanese Hollow Mewtwo. This is definitely a nine. Oh, come on. I don't think it's that bad. Oh, well, beggars can't be choosers, but hey, I love the Mewtwo Hollow from 150. We're approaching the end. Looks great. Iron Bundle Art Rare. We're, we're going 10 on this bad boy. Hey, take that. Let's keep it going. Aerodactyl, my favorite 151 hollow for sure. Beautiful artwork on this guy. I'm gonna guess a nine. Okay, mint nine. We will take that. All right, looks good to me. Maybe a little off center, but Veluza illustration rare from Paradox. I am going to guess a 10. Gem mint 10. Yes, snagged another gem mint 10. Nice. The submissions we've been getting back lately have been killing it. This looks great. Centering, great. Edges, great. Pikachu common from 151. 
Yes, I graded a common. It's one of my favorite Pokemon. Love me a Pikachu. And it looks great to me, so I'm guessing it didn't shoot. There we go, Gem Min 10 Pikachu. I will take that. Looking good, nothing to complain about here. Haunter, yep, we sent in the Haunter too. If I send in like commons and uncommons and stuff, it's because I researched the cost of a Gem Mint 10 and I thought they would fetch a Gem Mint 10. You take your chances, you take your shots, you know? I'm gonna have to go nine on this one. Mint nine, that's more realistic. I will take that, absolutely. Love that Haunter. We're getting close, people. Centering is a little off. The Kabutops Hollow, 151. I'm gonna guess a 10, but could be a nine. Okay, mint nine. I was on the fence, teeter-tottering between the two. We are doing so well with these new submissions. It's nuts. Reverse Hollow Gengar this time. It's gotta be a 10. I see nothing wrong. Yes. We got a Gem Mint 10 Reverse and a Gem Mint 10 Hollow. I'm loving this. This is insane. All right, five more. Looks immaculate. Starmie Reverse Hollow from Crimson Invasion. This is pack fresh and a PSA 10. I forget what it was worth, but it was surprisingly crazy for a Starmie. I'm going for the 10. Yes, dude. Yes. Let's finish off with a bang. Let's just whittle them all out as 10s. Come on. Here's the reverse hollow Pikachu. That's okay. This will not be a 10, so it'll definitely be a 9, though. Yep, mint 9. Pikachu reverse. Gotta love me a Pikachu, man. Last three. Minimal edgeware at the bottom. Nothing too wild. Oh, the Mew hollow from Fates Collide. I'm gonna go with a 9. Oh my gosh, yes. Yes. This is insane. Thumbs up, people. Last two. Let's just give them tens and call it a day. Come on. It looks great to me. We sent in two of the reverse hollow Pikachus. This one is definitely a 10. Not, nothing wrong here. Holy cow. We had 65 cards come back, and we almost got two equal piles. Let's get our final 10. Come on. If we sent in two Aerodactyls, this is definitely a nine. Oh my gosh, they did. We ended on two tens. People, that was incredible. This is our 10 pile. Please like this video and subscribe to the channel on your way out. And I will see you on the next one.